Hey, hey, it's around here. This training video is specifically on affiliate marketing and how to set up a workflow in your system IO account where you can resend one of your affiliates or a few of your affiliates the affiliate links that they can use to promote. The goal of doing this is to set up an automation that you can trigger again and again and again as needed. And also, it's an automation that you can make your affiliate's life easier. Now, this is something that I needed to set up in my own affiliate program, and therefore I'm gonna show you a live example of how I have it set up. And if you wanted to go and see what that actually looks like, you'll be able to go to a run.link forward slash JV, sign up for my affiliate program, and see the entire process. There's other aspects and pieces to this puzzle besides this particular automation, which I have other tutorials that I've covered as well. And if you want, there is going to be a downloadable PDF on how to set up an affiliate program with System.io step-by-step, which you'll be able to download somewhere around or below this video. So that's about it. I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen and show you the automation to send the affiliate links to your affiliates. So under workflows, you're going to see this one, affiliate links in brackets, everything. So I'm gonna click on it and you'll notice what I did. So first of all, I've created a tag and it's called DCT affiliate links trigger in brackets tag. So now DCT stands for .com truths. And when this tag is added, then this email gets sent. Now notice how this email is actually written. So I'm gonna click on choose and edit and you'll notice all the links are here. Hey, their first name, thanks for being part of the .com truths partner program. If you ever wanna browse to the offers again, this is the home page and or go to the marketplace in system IO. Okay, so you'll be able to uh, actually see what these two links are. So you can get an idea of what it is that I'm talking about because I've got a whole bunch of offers that people can actually check out and promote. So these are my websites. And by the way, if you wanna see this email as well, you just gotta click on send me my affiliate links, enter your name and email, and you'll be receive your email as well. So this page just explains everything that I offer and all the affiliate programs that people can promote. Now. Here I say, please make sure you copy the entire URL when you share it, i.e. make sure your affiliate ID is included at the end of the URL. So question mark SA equals affiliate ID. Now, what is this symbol? This symbol is a substitute variable, contact affiliate ID. So notice if I was to now add this again, contact affiliate ID, you're gonna notice it just adds this symbol. What this does, this particular like dynamic uh, text and so on, is it automatically adds the correct affiliate ID depending on which person this is being emailed to, which is really important to understand because you want to make their life easier. Now, you can see here that I have basically made a list of every single affiliate program because I've got a lot of affiliate programs over here. I've basically added the direct link to every single one of them. And at the end, I added S a question mark S a equals affiliate ID. And again, you will see it here S a or question mark S a equals affiliate ID. So to make your life really clear on how this works. It doesn't really matter what page somebody promotes of my stuff, okay? So for example, one website that I have in my system.io account is if you go to this page, members.comtruths.com forward slash landing page in day, blah, blah, blah. Now, if somebody wants to promote and turn this into an affiliate link, all they gotta do is take this stuff right here, like so, paste it here, and then add their affiliate ID. Okay, so now where is that affiliate ID? Where do you grab that? So I'm gonna exit uh, from here and I'm gonna open up and I'm gonna go to affiliate dashboard. In the affiliate dashboard, you're going to see this thing right here, affiliate ID. You are, when you have your login account, you're gonna see that as well. So you're gonna click on copy and then you're going to paste it right here. This is now your affiliate link. So it doesn't really matter what it is you're promoting from system. As long as the affiliate link or the affiliate program is managed through system, you just need to copy the link from here. Now, of course, you can always see what offers are available here and grab it. So if you want to promote my affiliate marketing challenge, you just grab it like so. And then this is your link to promote. Or if you want to promote something else, you want to promote the sales page directly, you will use this link as well. And your affiliate ID is already going to be included. SA something something. Okay. This is already going to automatically have your affiliate ID. So notice this link is already mine, uh, B01, and have a look as well. I'm gonna go back to the affiliate dashboard. You'll notice that mine does say that. 
B01, okay? So if you can look through this and actually go through one by one, and you will notice the one that's here one by one, you will see it's identical. So in the marketplace, your link is already going to be the exact one. It's just a matter of if you want to promote a different page from my website, then of course you can just add question mark SA equal something, okay? And to trigger the affiliate link directly to people, what I've done is let's just say I'm going to go to one of my contacts and this is just a demo contact. So I'm going to type in funnel education because that's one of my uh, test emails. And here's an example of a test email. So you see here, this is a test email. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on it and I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to search for the word links. And you see here, DCT affiliate links trigger, okay? Now you'll notice right now, this is the latest email which was sent, okay? Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click right here, I'm gonna save, and if I was to go back to this particular contact, which is this one, you see now that the tag is added, I'm gonna go back down, you are going to see that now this email was actually sent to this particular contact. This is a test contact, but this email was sent. Now you'll notice that this envelope is closed, which means they haven't actually opened it or looked it, looked at it. Now I'm going to show you what it looks like in the inbox. So here it is an email, all your affiliate links, which is the same one you saw in the workflow. And here is all the links automatically with the affiliate ID included. Now you'll notice that sometimes, it doesn't always pick up the affiliate ID exactly. So when somebody wants to get the affiliate link, they need to copy this entire thing and promote that that way. Don't just click on this because that's, this will not be your affiliate ID. You have to capture the whole thing basically. And that is how you resend the affiliate links to everybody that way to the individual person you want to send it to. Now, I'm going to refresh this page and you'll notice this envelope is now going to show open because I have now opened the email, right? Now let's just say I want to send it again. So what you want to do is you want to delete the tag. I'm going to grab this email. I'm going to click on save. I'm going to click on the email. I'm going to search for that email. I'm going to find that email. Now you'll notice that there is no tag for that because I've deleted it. So now you'll see that there is this one which is opened. And now I'm going to do it again. So I'm going to again search for the word links because I've got a lot of tags. Check it. Click on save. Go back to that account. The tag is added again. Here it is. And then now notice that I just got that email sent again. All right, because this envelope is closed. And then you'll notice here, there's another email again. So I'm going to click on show. And here is the email once again with the affiliate links and everything in the one place. So this is just to make um, your life easier, whether you are an affiliate for me and you want to know how to grab your links, make sure you capture everything and use that. Or if you are using this tutorial to actually set up your own affiliate program, that is how I would set that up. I would actually create that type of a workflow, uh, set up a trigger link with all your affiliate links in the one place to make your affiliate life a lot easier. So hope you get value from this and let me know if you have any questions. Somewhere around here, there'll be a playlist for System IO, so you can learn more about System IO and all my other tutorials. And also I do have a template on a, and a checklist on how to set up your own affiliate program, which is available in my templates and guides membership. If you want to check it out, go to aroundtemplates.com. You'll see that uh, particular um, mini course slash template as well. Thanks all for watching. I'll speak to you soon.